allowed that play to continue and the great call made on the ice. Remember we talked about in the second period where Nisimov was on that face-off win where he went to the blue paint. Look where he goes. Four check by Schmaltz and Kane. There's Anisimov. Kane with a little chip and Anisimov standing, what, two feet in front of the blue paint. Beats Hedrick Lundqvist to the far side. Excellent sequence for Schmaltz and then the creative little play by Kane in the open. He goes moving back to the front door as that shot is saved by Lundqvist at the rebound. And he scores! the face-off that Anisimov wins. Schmaltz with good patience and watch Chicago just go to work. The key, Cody Franson doesn't stop the puck. No shot blockers can set up. Anisimov gets to the front of the net and he takes a second opportunity to put it through the legs right there of Henrik Lundqvist. And cleared along for panic by Keith who will come to the bench for a change. Right back up the wing, it's carried by Schmaltz along to Anisimov. And he scores! Panic throws that puck into a dead area. Schmaltz skates into it. He hears an easy mob screen for it. Add up his, add up his goal stock from where he stepped the puck in tonight. I mean, maybe he reaches two feet max, but with that puck bouncing from our vantage point, looked like it was close. Wasn't that close? And his first career hat trick.